Will you have this man to be your wedded husband, to live together after God's ordinance in the holy estate of matrimony? Will you submit to him, serve him, love, honor, and keep him in sicknesses and in health, and forsaking all others, keep yourself only for him, so long as both of you shall live? Amen. Amen. Will you have this woman to be your wedded wife, to live together after God's ordinance in the holy estate of matrimony? Will you love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sicknesses and in health and forsaking all others? Keep yourself only for her so long as both of you shall live? Amen. I love Hadi because he is a very nice person to begin with. I have never had him drop my head. It's, it's quite commendable on the And um, he's kind. He's really kind. And um, he's very focused, which is really nice. I feel like he's always pushing me to be a better version of myself. So I feel like I have a partner who is helping me too. Hey, Kemu is amazing. She's, I, I, I think the word is spectacular. Eh? Yeah, she's, the, she's an amazing woman, she's got fairy, and uh, she's also intelligent, ambitious, and uh, respectful to her colleagues and even and cares a lot for her family. So those are the qualities uh, that attracted me to her. Well, we are gathered together, friends, in the sight of God and in the face of this company to join together this man and this woman in holy matrimony, which St. Paul commends to be honorable among all men. Therefore, it is not to be entered into unadvisedly or lightly, but reverently, discreetly, advisedly, and in the fear of God. Into this holy estate, these two persons present now come to be joined together. And always work things out together. I know you will make it in I wish you the best and God's blessings on the next day. Thank you for this. <laughs>
I had some nganga. I came into Baraki. I knew my commitment to you. As my lawful wedded husband. As my lawful wedded wife. To have and to hold. From this day forward. For better, for worse. In richness and in poverty. Standing with you in trials. Rejoicing with you in victories. To love and to cherish. In sicknesses and in health. Till death do us part. Till death do us part. According to God's holy ordinance. And there too I give you my vow. And there too I give you my vow. Amen. Wow. Very special moment right here. Amen. As a routine, we wish the two of you good life, get to your children. We have a haver for you. That haver in a letter to our Kwenu, what you go to a Kuja Kuja Maziwa. For the newlyweds, Hudson and Kemunto, wish you all the best. me greatest pleasure to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Hudson Nana.